Hi, friends of Data Exchange. We are excited to announce new Navisverse connectors for versions 2025, 2024, and 2023, which all support the creation of data exchanges from Navisworks, a feature that many of you have been waiting for. As you know, Navisworks can read more than 50 file formats and create coordination models. Thanks to its advanced search features, you can easily create selection sets of specific areas, which include elements from all loaded models. In this case, for example, I have created sets that include relevant elements for my workflow from both the architectural and the HVAC model. These can now be used to create a data exchange. But of course, you could also export a selection of the visible elements in the view. For now, I'll pick the level four and create a data exchange. Once it has been created, I can review it on ACC and, of course, load it through the connectors to Revit, Takla, Rhino, Inventor, or also to Power BI. But before we do that, let me show you another great thing about Navisworks. As you might know, Navisworks can also visualize the room geometry from Revit, which also means that we can create specific selection sets that include rooms and create data exchanges from this. Room geometry can only be exported to data exchange from Revit 2026 due to a Revit API limitation. But using Navisworks, you can also include room geometry from all the versions of Revit into data exchange, including the information attached to these rooms. I hear this request a lot, especially related to Power BI. And as you can see here, you can create great dashboards with our Power BI connector to visualize your rooms. The easiest way to find all the connectors is always through the Autodesk App Store. And in case of the beta connectors, like the Navisworks is, you will be redirected to our feedback community, where you can download the installers and also provide feedback. We are looking forward to hearing what you think about this connector and how we can improve it in the future versions.